This is a geothermal heat pump. Unlike most heat pumps that you see, which are called air source heat pumps, this one gets its heat from lines that are running through the ground. These are the two lines. So water is flowing up and down through a whole system. In this case, it's about six foot below ground level and it runs for about 300 feet in three loops. There's different kinds. Some of them can be just in a well of sorts that go straight down much further. In any case, the difference is that a geothermal heat pump is pulling heat from a constant heat source. That deep in the ground, it is, in these parts at least, that's a constant temperature. It's below the two foot freeze line and it stays about 55 degrees all the time. If you had an air source heat pump, it's pulling from the outside air. And when it's warm-ish outside, no problem, it works very well. But as soon as it gets too cold, there's just not enough ambient heat in the air outside for it to work properly. These ones tend to be more efficient, mostly just because of that. Doesn't matter what the outside temperature is. It works just as well. The demand will be more if it's very cold because your house is getting colder faster. But the actual efficiency of how it pulls the heat out of the ground, that's about the same all year round. Like other heat pumps, they're very efficient compared to any other electrical source. They're about two and a half times more efficient, which means, roughly speaking, for every one unit of energy that it uses, it gives you about two and a half units of heat in your house, unlike electricity, which is a one-to-one -one ratio.